What we got? Oh! You got a wee buddy system with it again. Well, it makes sense because you have the, the story mode DLC with the thing. Oh, it's like a wee robot drone. It's like freaking murder drones. Oh my god. Okay. Um, some sort of factory. That's a... What the f... What? What are these gelatin right creatures? What the hell? Freaking... The, these are new enemies. They're for new and new enemies. Oh, wait, that's Pearl! That has to be Pearl. That has Pearl's crown on their head. That has to be Pearl's crown, right? Come on, I'm not lying. Oh, oh, it's a dead fish! That's dead fish! It's Pearl! I was right! That is definitely a dead fish. It's not bad, it's not who got sucked in. Never mind, it's Achant. But it's so dead fish, come on. Chip into the palette. Oh, it's the menu system! Is it? What? Splash damage runs me. Okay, these are like, these are like buffs. <laughs> I'm so confused. Like, what's going on with this? Um, sure. Like, upgrades? I'm a bit confused. I still try to process this. That's a cool intro. That's a cool way to enter a stage. Like, crystallization almost. What the heck? That's a boss. That has to be a boss. <laughs> Side order. Yay! Excitement in there! I have a theory for this entire thing with the DLC. Reading some of the dialogue in general, it is going to take place in some sort of matrix. And that's not just because of superstition. I see things like code in the walls. I am seeing the text saying, like, they're saying they're getting sucked into a place. It looks like they're in some sort of, like, matrix verse or something like that. And it would also make sense why Pearl's a drone and not, like, herself. I really hope this is a good DLC. I am excited as f-